Sam in Appley Wood School and we've got a mini robot and there's Rhea who's going to show us what we can do with it. So open the box Rhea and then you can show us what's going on. So you can see inside you've got the processor. Can you switch it on then Rhea? And you get a little LED. So move your board and we'll see what you've done. So you've got four letters. R, A, T, S. So let's try one of the letters. So there it goes, Ozobot all the way around the R. And you can see that it's got two wheels. If the line is too thin, so that's quite interesting, Rhea's made the line too thin, it doesn't work. So let's try that ah. Can we try the ah, Rhea? And we'll see if that works. So, at the moment, when it gets to the end of a line, it stops, but we're gonna try and show people how to make it um, turn around 180 degrees. So thank you, Rhea, that's really good work. Well, here I am with Isabel. What are we gonna do now? Um, we've made a word, so we're gonna use Right, go on then, put the Ozobot onto the start of the W. And it seems to be working, so it's got a sensor underneath and it senses the black line. Let's hope it goes round the zero. Oh, not zero, it's an O. And it missed the O out. Now, later on, we're going to see if we can make the Ozobot turn round at the end. So I'm just going to show you, it's more likely to go along a straight line, but sometimes it will come round. But it does quite like straight lines. Well actually, it's gone round again. So it seems to have a mind of its own. And we'll just show our <laughs> viewers the sensor. And there's the sensor underneath. Thank you for watching. Well, I'm joined by Thomas now, and he's going to show us something else that Ozobot can do. So, if you put blue and red together, it'll make the Ozobot U turn. So, let's try it on this one. So, we've made a line, and sure enough, it's following the line, and then blue and red makes it turn. Thank you for joining us. Now notice, Mr. Smith made two mistakes. He did a line, he did colours too close to the edge, and here he chose the wrong type of blue. So it's slightly different to that blue. So you've got to get the same, the correct colour blue, and make them the correct size. So I'll take you back to the one that was correct. So they've got to be about that size, and it shows you on the instructions the size that you have to make them. Why not try different colours and then it will do different things. Thank you for joining us. When you buy an Ozobot, you get this special mat and it's got all the codes on. So blue, black, blue is turbo mode. So let's switch it on and see what happens. Can you see it went faster? Now it's whizzing round, the lights change colour. And if you look inside, you can see the processor and that's where everything is done. All the calculations are done so that it knows what speed to go, what colour to change to. And as we said, blue and red should make it rotate 180 degrees. You can see the charger. There's the charger. 